today's video is going to be all about our second chakra box. It is going to be our root chakra. I'm going to show this. I just think the way she has this packaged is so cute. So let's get right into all of our awesome goodies. All right, we have the card and a description of what these are, and I will be reading off of this. In each box, you get a sticker. I actually, these are peel off and they're clear. Um, I put these by my chakra shelves. This is my second set, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with this, but I will find a good home for them. Okay, so this is a meditation card that you get in each box. This is Root Chakra Meditation, Growing Your Consciousness Tree. So this tells you some good ideas to meditate, to get your root chakra going. So this is pretty cool. And I, each month, go through these. And our yoga pose is the tree pose. Because our root chakra, it, it has a lot to do with the actual physical nature of things. It's like grounding and security, but it also puts you closer to nature itself. So, fitting that the yoga pose of the month is the tree pose. Okay, the first thing right on top is something very familiar to everyone on my channel. And it is a tree, no, flower of life altar cloth and we all know that this is a crystal grid cloth and you don't have to use just crystals in your grids you can use other things like um, maybe some dried flowers some real flowers tri twigs branches anything in nature that might be something nice and fun to do for this month is to bring some nature pieces into your grid maybe we'll make a chakra grid a root chakra grid out of this and I'll take a picture for this video. And it's always cute because her crinkly paper corresponds with which other, whichever chakra you have for that, that month. Okay, here is our Awaken Essential Root Chakra Roller Ball with essential oils. And on our little card, it tells you what the main oils are in this. And on the back of the card, it has, I am earth, grounded, strong, protected, and nourished. I am divine, I am a divine being of lights, and I am always safe and secure. I am grounded and connected to Mother Earth. I am abundant, and money flows to me. The universe will always provide for me. I am healthy and supported in all that I do. So let's smell this guy. It smells very earthy and woody. Uh, it does, it kind of smells like the dirt. <laughs> I know that's a horrible, horrible uh, description. I do get some frankincense in there, but it does, it smells very earthy to me. Um, yeah, there's just, there's cypress, that's what I'm getting. I'm getting cypress and cedar wood right off the bat. Oh, there's a whole bunch in here and it's also got some gem elixirs like Terminaline, Jet, Smoky Quartz. Those are the grounding crystals, so of course that's that uh, goes along with your root chakra. Um, yeah, so I get that earthy, like I said, I could smell the cypress and the cedar wood right off the bat. Okay, we have some sage. And our card over here will probably tell us what kind of sage this is white sage, or what we're dealing with. Yep, white sage wand. Smudging is a ritual to purify and clear your aura and space by burning the sage as needing, needed. Uh, as you do this, visualize the smoke taking away any negative energy or darkness from your life. Sage is always an excellent thing to have handy. I use it quite a bit for cleansing my crystals. And just as what the card said, I like to clear my space from time to time. We'll put that guy right there. All right, next in the box is our Root Chakra Balance Tea. 
Now this one I might try. The last month I could tell you right off the bat I wasn't going to like it. But this one has uh, rose hips, hawthorn berries, raspberry leaves, hibiscus, and nettle. So I will try this month and tell you how it is next month. Okay, the last thing in the box is our little baggie of goodies. So I'm going to take this out and we're going to go through these one at a time. Okay, we have a mucolite mucolite bracelet lots of different colors in there mucolite is quite stabilizing and may assist one in decision making of all sorts physically mucolite supports vitality and strength it also felicitates connection to the earth's electromagnetic energy and currents i don't have a mucolite bracelet i think i only have one piece of mucolite in my collection Usually, I think, if I remember from my first set of box, you get some kind of jewelry piece in each one, which I like. So, some mucolite. Cool. So, our next piece, and we can recognize this right off the bat, is black tourmaline, raw black tourmaline. Repels and protects from negative energy that may deflect radiation. Black tourmaline activates grounding between the root chakras and earth center, enhancing one's physical well-being. Transforms negative energy and thoughts into positive, usable energy. Black tourmaline, black tourmaline purifies one's auric field and etheric body. And I use tourmaline quite a bit. I have my bedroom gridded out with tourmaline to keep all the oogly booglies out i use this quite a bit and i also travel with it a good hint now we have three really little tiny guys right up like that and these are garnets this transmutes negative energy in chakras produces expansions expansion and awareness enhances passion and creative creative powers, stimulates balancing, calming, and protection. It protects your home and a piece of garnet above your doorway. You will find three pieces of garnet in your bag. So, yeah, some garnets, which is fitting for the red root chakra. Okay, our next guy here is, this says it is smoky quartz raw. This one looks pretty clear, actually. But a nice little hunk of smoky quartz. Smoky quartz may deepen your connection to the physical and natural world. It brings power and strength, relieving fears, especially associated with the physical existence here on Earth. It may provide and protect. It may provide a protective shield around its user and is a remarkable tool for deep meditation, spiritual ceremonies, and rituals. And we also know for some other things, this is really good for pain relief. I have lots of smoky quartz and it happens to be probably at the moment one of my favorite crystals. We'd like to get our hands on every smoky quartz near me. All right, now our next stone is a tiger eye. And we know tiger eye is good for courage and strength. Let's see what else it is good for. May bring stability and awareness while integrating the spiritual with the physical realms. Assists in balancing root, sacral, and solar plexus chakras. Tiger's eye resonates with the frequencies of the earth and provides a warm, stable energy for prayers and meditation. And I'm sure we'll probably see this in the next few boxes because this is good for the first three chakras. Okay, the last guy in the box is a red jasper. Jasper comes in a few different colors, but it is fitting. We get the red one today. So let's read a little bit about red jasper. It stimulates the root chakra and promotes Earth's connection. It awakens energy and offers protection in the spiritual and physical realms. Red Jasper cleanses the aura and assists in vivid dream recall. It has the ability to detect negative energy, alleviate stress, absorb electromagnetic energy, and promote astral travel. Okay, so there is the goodies we got in our chakra box. We have lots of work to do coming up for this month. And I'm going to probably get some things from outside, and we're going to do a quick crystal grid. 
Okay, here is our root chakra crystal grid that I set up real quick. I wanted to incorporate some things from nature in this, so I went out and got some lilies from my backyard. I also got some flowers off of my hosta plants. We have a red jasper pyramid in the middle as our activation point. We used our three garnets we got in today's box along with a couple others. Our accent crystals are tourmalines to help with our protection. Our outside ring is made up of more red jasper and some smoky quartz crystals. Don't forget to activate your crystal grids that you make at home, folks. You can use any kind of wand. Today, I'm just going to use this piece of tourmaline. And we're going to get the energy flowing and out into our space, just like so. Well, I hope you guys liked today's video. If you did, give it a like and subscribe, please. Thank you for watching today and joining us. I hope you liked our Root Chakra Box unboxing. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.